Alright, here's this old clock radio from the 60s or 50s or something like that. I'm not sure when exactly. But anyway, I got this from that one house that burnt down. Um, yeah, I mean it's not in the best of shape, but it does work, sort of. Um, not a lot of stations come in. I get more stations actually in the garage than I do out here, or in the house, or whatever. But anyway, here it is. It is a General Electric lighted dial. Sleep, snooze, on, wake, off. Then you get the tuner, speaker, the top of it. I think it melted there or something. That one thing's broken. This thing ain't in the best of shape, like I said. The side of it. This thing's hard to do one-handed. The back of it. It has that. And there's the cord. It's got an outlet. A few vents. That's for the clock, I think. And there's the other side. And the bottom, which isn't much info on the bottom of it. Sticker fell off, I guess. So, I mean, the clock does work, as you can clearly see. That one hand is not working. The radio does work too. Um, you turn it on like this. It's one of those ones that has the tubes in it, so it takes a minute to warm up. Give it a minute here. Uh, yeah. Um, I want to get that one station now. Mm. The rest of it is that. You can tell it wants to kit stuff in, but something isn't working right. So yeah, it only works on the one station, but, I don't know, I don't know if someone out there knows what's wrong with it, but, if someone knows, um, let me know, I might have you fix it for me, because I don't know how to do this kind of stuff, but I do want to keep it, because it is pretty cool, but anyway, there's it, that's it, and thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Have a good day.